All right, guys, so I've talked a lot on this channel about how tech sales as a career is one of the best possible jobs that you can try to get, especially if it's just your first entry level job. So much opportunity right now. You can make a lot of money right off the bat. You can get into it without any background experience or a college degree. And there are literally people that are graduating from high school and getting tech sales jobs like the month after. So this is one of those massive opportunities right now. For some reason, there's just a huge gap in the market. They simply do not have enough people who have these skills in tech sales and there is just a ton of opportunity but with that being said is it worth it for you to go to these expensive tech sales boot camps that are often over ten thousand dollars because chances are after watching one of my videos about tech sales you probably had a bunch of ads pop up telling you to do that so that is what we're going to be talking about in this video i'm not going to go into a lot of detail on each one because there are like 15 total boot camps we're going to go over so i'm just going to give you my opinion on each one based off of how much they cost how fast they get you the job, their reviews online, etc. All right, so if you appreciate this type of video, let me know by gently tapping that like button. Let's go ahead and jump right into it with the first one on the list, and I'm going to go in alphabetical order, which is Careerist. So overall, I do like Careerist. They have a tech sales boot camp, and then they also have a sales engineer boot camp, which is kind of one step ahead. On coursereport.com, they have over 1,200 ratings with a 4.6 star rating. On careerkarma.com, it's 4.7 out of 5 with over 300 ratings. And then the tech sales course itself, is four weeks and it costs around $3,800. So $3,800 might sound like a lot of money, but that's actually one of the cheaper boot camps. And you're going to see here in a few minutes, there's boot camps that literally cost $30,000. And then I really like that it's only four weeks because I'll be honest with you, tech sales should not really take all that long to train people with. I've seen a lot of people get a job in a month, month and a half, sometimes even less than a month. And then if you scroll down and look at the actual testimonials, I do like this because these are people that you can look up on LinkedIn. Um, in the testimonial itself, it actually says that they were able to get a job, which compare this to like digital marketing bootcamp testimonials. It's like night and day, much, much better. And then you can kind of scroll through to other testimonials and it looks like they have quite a few. And this doesn't surprise me at all because tech sales is just wide open right now. It's very, very easy to get a job. So I do not doubt that a lot of these boot camps are getting people results, but this video is ranking the boot camps compared to each other, right? So just because a boot camp is getting people results, that doesn't mean it's going to get a high ranking, right? If you're getting people results and charging them $30,000 versus another boot camp that's getting people results, charging them less than a thousand, then obviously the one that's charging less than a thousand is going to rank better. But with that being said, overall, I do like Careerist. Um, they do have some good options and I'm going to go ahead and put them into A tier. Next one on the list is going to be Claris Way. Now, this one was not on Course Report for some reason but they were on Career Karma and they're ranked five out of five with over 300 ratings. Now, Claris Way is a pretty hardcore bootcamp, right? It's six months and it costs $11,400, but they do have multiple programs that they offer. But with that being said, five stars with over 300 ratings is very impressive. And it does look like they're absolutely getting people results. So I'm not saying Claris Way is bad by any means, but with that being said, I do think that there are other ones that are better options on this list, but they're still getting people great results. Obviously, people are happy. That's why they're giving them five-star ratings. So I'm gonna give this one A tier status. Next one on the list is going to be Course Careers. And you might guess by the name Course Careers that this is actually not a boot camp. It's a course. And you would be right. So the thing about boot camps is the reason that they were charging so much money since 2010, that's kind of when boot camps started, is the fact that they had physical locations and there was a lot of infrastructure cost, right? If you have a physical location, you have to rent it, you have to hire a janitor, you have to hire all kinds of other people, people to answer the phones, et cetera. There's a lot of infrastructure costs. And so it makes sense when they're charging people thousands and thousands of dollars because it costs thousands of dollars to hold these boot camps. But then when the pandemic happened, almost all of the boot camps went online but for some reason, they kept the cost the same, right? So even though their expenses went down tremendously, for some reason, they kept the cost of the boot camps the same. Almost all of them did this. So if you think about it, what really is the difference between a comprehensive interactive online course and an online boot camp? 
there's basically no difference except for the cost. The boot camps cost 10, 20, 30 times more. And so course careers came along, they saw this, they saw that there was just a huge discrepancy in the value they're providing and the cost that they're charging, and they created an online course that does the exact same thing for people. So course careers, five-star rating on careercommer.com, five out of five, perfect. And it's also flexible, so you can take as long as you want, but it typically takes four weeks to get through the course. Now, I've actually had people tell me that they got through the course in like a week and a half, but that's pretty hardcore. You'd have to be doing it you know, every single day. And the price of course careers is $500, which is literally 1 60th of the cost of one of the other ones on this list. Now on top of that, they have tons of interviews, testimonials and reviews, and they have the type that I like. So there's basically two different types of testimonials that I really like. The first one is video interviews where they're just asking a person questions and it's just kind of a back and forth. It's like a conversation that you get to watch. And then the second one is interviews where you can actually look the person up. You can verify one, that they're a real person and two, that they are actually happy with the service. Because when you see reviews on these websites where it's just a quote from somebody, you don't know anything about the context of the review for all you know it's just an exit survey right it's like they're asking you what was your favorite part about this boot camp and then the next question is what is your least favorite part about this boot camp and then they take your answer to what was your favorite part about the boot camp if they like it and they put that as a review so in my opinion that's kind of a bit of an unethical way of getting reviews and overall it's just a pretty big red flag for me and when it comes to the reviews course careers has a bunch of them that i really like first of all the owner of course careers the ceo troy buckholt he actually actually has a YouTube channel where he interviews a bunch of people. There's also a lot of interviews that are on other YouTube channels as well. Then of course, there's a ton of reviews on LinkedIn. All you have to do is just type in course careers on LinkedIn and you're gonna see a bunch of people who give reviews on it. So yeah, it's pretty obvious to me that this one is the best value by far. I mean, it's not even close. I do think most of these boot camps are getting people results. I think Course Careers is getting just as good of results at like 1 30th or 1 60th of the price. And in many cases, they're doing it much faster and more flexibly because of the fact that it's an online course. So yeah, definitely check it out. I've actually interviewed people who have gone through Course Careers. I have an entire playlist. I guess I'll like link that up somewhere up here and course careers does have a free introductory course if you're interested in tech sales or you think you might be interested in it and you want to learn more i'll link that down in the description as well as the pinned comment and if you use course career service which not only trains you in tech sales but they actually get you guaranteed interviews then use my coupon code i believe it's shane 50 and you'll get 50 dollars off but yeah this one goes into s tier for sure really good one all right, so next one on the list this is gonna be one of the very expensive ones and that is going to be Elevate. So Elevate, 4.8 stars on Course Report, 4.9 stars on Career Karma. Um, not that many ratings, only about 20 ratings on Course Report and 70 on Career Karma. Um, it says that it takes about 10 weeks, which is a little bit longer than average. And overall, it costs about $25,000. Within seven weeks of joining Elevate, I landed five interviews and two competitive job offers. So that is good, don't get me wrong, but there's literally only one review and it doesn't look like one where you can look it up on LinkedIn and there's no context to it. So again, pretty low quality review here. And the fact that there's only one, there really should be like at least five if not like 10 of them that you're showcasing. So I'm really not seeing anything on this sales page and in the research that I did on them to justify the $25,000 price tag. And you do have to actually dig a little bit to find out how much it costs. And by the way, if the price has changed, please go ahead, comment down below. And you know, if you see this and you're like, oh, it's not 25,000, it's actually 20,000. Well, that's kind of their fault because they're not being transparent with their pricing. You know, it's not easy to find the prices for these and it really should be. That is a massive red flag when you look at a website and you're like, oh, you have to get on a sales call with us to find out the price or something like that. Typically, that's because it's unbelievably expensive. So yeah, the price that I found was about $25,000. I'm sure they are getting people actual results, but at that price tag, you need an abundance of evidence to show why people should go with your service over other services that are doing the exact same thing for much cheaper. So I'm gonna have to put Elevate into F tier. Next one on the list, we're gonna be talking about FlockJ. Now, FlockJ is rated 4.9 out of five stars on Career Karma. It costs around $7,650, and it's approximately 10 weeks to get through it. So overall, I saw a lot of really good things with this one. It looks like they're partnered with a lot of companies, um, but you know, the 7,650, it's just not competitive with some of the better ones on this list. And so for that reason, I'm sure they're getting people results, but I'm gonna have to put it into C tier. 
Next one on the list is going to be High Rise Academy. And this one is ranked 4.96 out of five on Course Report, but there's only about 25 ratings and I couldn't find them on Career Karma. Now they cost around $9,500 and it takes about six to 12 weeks to get through the course. Now they're also a Germany-based company, so just keep that in mind. That's probably why they don't have as many ratings. So this might be a good option if you're somebody from that area. But overall with the ratings and everything, didn't impress me too much. 9,500 is a lot of money. I'm gonna go ahead and put them into C tier. Next one on the list is going to be pre-hired. Now, this one is interesting because on the surface, pre-hired looks pretty good. You look at coursereport.com, you see 4.89 out of five stars. You look at careerkarma.com, you see 4.9 out of five stars. And this is both with you know several hundred ratings. So when you look into pre-hired a little more deeply, you start to see some things that aren't very consistent. For instance, they have a guarantee that says 12 months, they're gonna get you a $60,000 job. That's the guarantee that they have. And then they say that the variable cost is $30,000, but it's capped, right? So you're only gonna pay up to $30,000. And this, of course, is for the income share agreement, which a lot of people go for those. And it says on the website that you'll be paying 12.5% of your pre-tax income for 48 months in order to pay this off. But then it says right after that the average monthly payment is $500. So if you look at the numbers here, this isn't adding up because if they're guaranteeing that you're gonna be making at least $60,000, then 60,000 times 12.5% divided by 12 is $625 per month. So how could the average be $500 a month payment when the lowest amount of money that they're guaranteeing would be $625 a month. Doesn't make sense, right? So if you are able to make that $60,000 number, let's do the math there. So 60,000 um, times 12.5% divided by 12 and then multiplied by 48 is exactly $30,000. So you're pretty much gonna be paying $30,000 as long as they do their side of the bargain, right? So if they get you a $60,000 job, you're gonna be paying at least $30,000. So that's really sketchy right off the bat and at the very least that's misleading, okay? But then when you look a little more deeply into it, you start to see some really bad reviews. So for instance, this person said, I graduated from pre-hired back in 2019 when the boot camp was just a few months old. Back then the cost was $2,500. I was pretty amazed to see that it's now $30,000. I honestly doubt that the price hike was reflected in the quality of tuition. The course duration is still the same 12 weeks where they show you about 15 hours of pre-recorded videos with basic information that is available online for free. The course is not worth $30,000. The course founder, Joshua Jordan, sued nearly 300 students across the country to collect millions of dollars. They are currently under investigation by the Delaware Department of Justice. This info is available online. Please do your research and be safe. So basically what this course did, and I've seen this with a lot of other boot camps through the years, unfortunately, is when they first started, they had a great product for the price point, right? They were getting people jobs. It was $2,500 everyone was happy and that's why they had so many positive reviews. Then they used all those positive reviews and their good reputation to increase the price of the course to something that is absolutely ridiculous. And to somebody who doesn't look into it very deeply, you think that all those positive reviews came from people paying $30,000 for the course. When in reality, it was much cheaper just a short period of time ago. And then you see the owner is suing his former students, which is really a massive red flag to see as well. And if you look into it a little more deeply, not not only is the owner suing his former students, not only is he being investigated by the Delaware Department of Justice, but on top of that, the boot camp is also being sued by the Washington Attorney General. So this is why you have to be very careful when you look into these things. Make sure you do your research on these guys. Like it's very easy for these boot camps to do a good job for a few years and then bait and switch people and then start, you know, delivering an inferior product just to cash out on it. So pre-hired goes into F tier. Next one on the list is going to be Pre-Sales Academy. Um, this one didn't have all that many reviews, but the reviews they did have were good. So it was a five-star rating on Course Report with like 10 reviews and five stars on Career Karma with around 10 reviews. The cost is $7,000 and it takes about eight weeks. So I didn't see any massive red flags with this one. I'm sure they're getting their students results, but it also doesn't stand out to me. So I'm gonna put them into C tier. Next one on the list is Sales Platoon. And I really like this one, it's great. Um, they didn't have that many reviews, but it's only for veterans, right? Is that clear? Yes, Drill Sergeant! So, on coursereport.com, they have a 4.9 out of five star rating with about 20 reviews. And they say that it takes about 12 weeks. Now this one is actually free if you're a veteran, but are they really free? Is there ever 
anything that's actually free? The answer to that, if you have any life experience whatsoever, is no, of course. So the way that this company is probably making money is they're essentially uh, partnering with other companies out there and they're getting paid like a recruiter would. So if they match somebody up who's a really good talent with a company, the company will compensate them, you know, something like a few thousand dollars, kind of like a recruiter would get paid if they find somebody who's a really good match for the company. So that's most likely how they're getting paid here. But with that being said, really good reviews. If you're a veteran, definitely go for that one it's free so might as well do it um, i will put sales platoon into a tier next one on the list is going to be school 16. So this is another one didn't have that many reviews 4.96 out of 5 with over 20 reviews um it was a pretty reasonable price though about three thousand five hundred dollars and they say that they take around eight weeks so overall i saw a lot of good things with this one um pretty high rankings as well 4.96 out of 5 that's great i'm gonna put this one into a tier Next one on the list is Springboard, and they do have some lower ratings, uh, but they have a lot of them. So 4.64 out of 5 on Course Report and 4.6 out of 5 on Career Karma. And overall costs about $5,000. That is relatively reasonable compared to a lot of the other ones on the list. And it has a ton of ratings. You know, when you see those lower ratings one, you have to be a little bit skeptical because it would be pretty easy just to, you know, pay a few people to leave reviews or even just leave fake reviews. So uh, you want to be a little bit skeptical of that. But uh, overall, I did like Springboard pretty good. Um, I'm going to put it into A tier. Next one on the list is SV Academy. 4.84 out of 5 on Course Report, 4.9 out of 5 on Career Karma, and they both had over 200 ratings. They cost around $10,000, and it says that it only takes four weeks. But still, I think that's like the third or the fourth most expensive on this list. Uh, $10,000 is a lot of money. Um, I'm going to be honest with you, tech sales jobs are not that difficult to get. I mean, you could probably just do it on your own. It would just take a lot of extra time. So I highly recommend just going with one of the cheaper ones um, that is going to save you time and probably money in the long run. SV Academy, I'll go ahead and put them into D tier. Uvaro is next on the list. Um, they had around 50 ratings on coursereport.com and they did get a five-star rating. So pretty good. Um, cost around $6,000 and the boot camp, it was kind of hard to tell the length, but it's somewhere between four to 12 weeks. It's kind of a boot camp, like internship combination or something. But yeah, it said four to 12 weeks. Overall, pretty good. Didn't really stand out all that much to me. So I put them into B tier. And then Victory Lap was kind of in the same category, um, had about, you know, 30 ratings or so, 4.9 out of 5 stars on Course Report, and it costs around $8,900. So again, that's getting kind of high. Uh, the length of the boot camp is about five weeks. So I'm sure they're getting people results, but the price point to me just isn't very interesting. So I'm going to put them into C tier. So yeah, overall, that's my opinion on these different boot camps. I do think that tech sales boot camps are doing a good job of getting people actual results. But just like any industry out there, there are some bad apples, of course, that you should avoid. And at the end of the day, you want to choose the one that's the best value. The best value here by far was course careers. It really wasn't even close. They're getting the same results, if not better results than everyone else. And they're doing it for like $450. If you want to check out some interviews of people who have gotten into tech sales, I'll put the playlist right here you can check it out if you haven't done it already go ahead gently tap that like button hit the subscribe button ring the notification bell and comment down below any thoughts comments criticisms etc and i will see you next time